Hi, my name is Mark Renz. I'm with the University of Wisconsin Extension and I'm here today to talk to you about how to identify leafy spurge, an invasive plant in Wisconsin. Uh, this plant is very common on roadside areas and has been spreading rapidly over the last 10 years. We find it in drier sites. It tends to be more dominant like we see here, uh, less dominant in some of our wetter sites. This plant is a creeping perennial plant that spreads by creeping roots but is really easy to identify by several key characteristics. Starting with the leaf, we see the leaf is long and linear very, and a bluish green tint. And if we break that leaf off, what we find is we see a nice white milky sap that is protruded through that. Very few species do that that looks similar to leafy spurge. So that's a great characteristic. Moving on to the flowers, we find these are actually fruit that have a yellowish green bract around them that can produce a couple seeds. Uh, these seeds are actually explosively dehissed and spread out and lead to further infestation. Uh, these flowers do persist for several months in the summertime in this unique color. Uh, in addition to that, we also have creeping roots, as I mentioned earlier, which are dark in color. They also have that white milky sap, which uh, helps make it a key identifying characteristic for this plant. Um, there is a, one similar plant that you could get confused with, which is called cypress spurge. That plant does not tend to grow as tall and has smaller leaves that are much more needle-like, but that plant is also invasive and should be targeted for control as well. Uh, that's it and good luck and happy weeding.